Hey guys, you're watching Millionaire Success Habits. I'm Makai Block and this is Limitless North TV. Today, in this topic, we're going to talk about reading for 20 minutes every single day on a focus that will push you forward in your life, that will inspire you, that will motivate you, that will teach you something you need to know to become more successful, whether it's a particular skill you need to develop in your industry, or whether it's motivation, inspiration, entrepreneurship, wealth management, any of the above. This is a habit that so many top men and women use in their lives that propels them forward because they're all of a sudden reading for 20 minutes every day, encountering new ideas, new paths to success, new mentors basically that will change the way that they think, that will give them ideas that they've never encountered before, that will inspire them, that will keep them motivated and keep them moving towards their goals. Now this is something that I want to encourage you to do and as we talk about this, I just want you to think about how your life might change if you implemented this habit into it daily. Now for myself, I never really read a whole lot as I was growing up and even going through college. I, I did read a lot of uh, Christian books and I, I wanted to understand my faith and what I believed. I wanted to understand basis for that and background on that so I was pretty studied and learned in that area. But as far as business was concerned, I, I never picked up a business book. And as far as self-help and personal development was concerned, you couldn't even catch me near that. I mean, I just thought that was something that the people who needed it would get. But I didn't realize that we all truly needed that kind of content because it drives us towards being our better selves. And so it wasn't until I got down to Los Angeles after I graduated college that I actually picked up maybe my first business book, and it was Richard Branson's How I Lost My Virginity, uh, or Losing My Virginity, How I Made a Fortune, and you know had fun doing work my way. And his book, his autobiography, was one of the most captivating books I've ever read. And as I, I went through this book and just experienced this brilliant mind that went from struggle to success that changed his entire life around and detailed the processes that he implemented in the, in, the, in the process of becoming a billionaire. I mean, my mind was just floored. I was so excited as I read this book, I couldn't even put it down. And I, I remember my brother and my really good friend were reading at the same time and we just couldn't quit talking about it, about the things that we encountered, the concepts, the amazingness of Richard Branson getting to where he was in life. And that was maybe my first real business book of any substance that I picked up and read and maybe the next one that I did was Tim Ferriss's Four Hour Work Week, and that was maybe a few months later. And I remember reading that book and just having my mind blown and just being like, "This is this is gold. There's ideas in here that I can implement in my life that will absolutely change my business and change the way that I live my life and change the results that I'm getting." And a lot of it doesn't apply, but some of it does, and so. Let me try these things. And I remember implementing a few things, like even outsourcing some of my work and hiring virtual assistants. It was a concept I'd never even heard of. I didn't even know that existed, let alone that I could do it in my own business. And when I begin to, or began to implement that, it changed so much. My income went up, my stress levels went down, I was able to get so much more work done. And I just realized, man, if, if these two books can inspire me so much, there's got to be so much more out there that I can digest and ingest and concentrate on and, and focus on and implement my life and just totally change who I am, how I do my business, and what I'm experiencing out of life. And it wasn't long after that uh, that I began to pick up more and more business books and, and just start to notice all these new concepts, all these new tactics and strategies and techniques that people used and habits that they implemented in their life, which is the basis for millionaire success habits and it just changed everything for me and I came across some YouTube videos a guy called Stefan Palernos of Project Life Mastery another guy named Robin Sharma and they talked about their morning rituals the fact that they would get up in the morning at 5 a.m. and go through this series of steps these series of rituals and routines that they would do every single day in order to get into a peak state to accomplish more in their day, to accomplish more in their life, to be more focused and motivated, inspired on their goals, and to actually achieve things. And part of what they said was that they read for 20 minutes every day, at least. You know, they, they had a book that they would just go to every morning and read in it. 
And then Brian Tracy, I heard him start to talk about it, that top men and women read for 20 minutes daily. And then I was listening to Jim Rohn and I was hearing all these um, just amazing seminars and speeches. And he would talk about that. If you would just utilize your time and listen to audio books or read every morning, you could get the equivalent of a college degree in a year, of a, of a master's degree in a year, of a doctorate in a year. If you read 20 minutes every day, think of how many books you could consume in a year. 25, 30, 50 books in a year if you're really pushing it. Think of the knowledge that you would gain. And so that inspired me because not only did it make sense and not only was I experiencing it by reading a handful of these books that were totally changing my life and my routines and my habits and my results, now all of a sudden I started hearing all these very successful people saying they do the same. But not only do they just read, they read systematically. They have a process in place whereby every day they ensure that they're in books. They're deep in ideas and thoughts and cultivating new knowledge, new beliefs, new practices, and new concepts in their life. They're giving their imagination place to take root, to flourish on someone else's words and processes. And then Warren Buffett says that, you know, typically he reads the majority of his days and does very little work, but the majority of what he's doing is taking in new ideas and then executing them. And then other rich people, other very successful people say that they read so consistently, but all they're looking for is that one idea in a book that will change their business and change their life. That one idea that they can implement to increase their income. And so I started getting this influx of very successful role models and mentors and people that I was inspired by and motivated by. They were all saying, read, read consistently. But not only that, make it part of your habits. Make it part of your routines. Build this habit of reading 20 minutes daily. And if you can do it in the morning before you go to work, before you experience any of the craziness of the day and set your mind on success, on developing a skill, on having a purpose, on becoming better, Think of how that will carry you through the day. And so I began to implement that, my li or that in my life, and it just changed everything. I've read about, uh, I want to say, close to 60 or 70 books over the last year and a half, two years. And so many of them are audiobooks. I'm blessed to have time throughout my day where I can put an audiobook on and do work while I listen to it and take in that knowledge. But I, I sit down every morning as I do my morning ritual, my morning routine, which you guys can see in my other Millionaire Success Habits videos on this channel and I read consistently for 20 minutes every day and it just changes so much. I've learned so many beneficial things by doing that and so have so many other people and so I want to encourage you to begin this practice of reading consistently and I would encourage you to read 20 minutes every day, every morning, to spend 20 minutes of your entire day learning something new, taking in new knowledge. Because the reality is that success leaves clues. And if you can learn from other successful people, your journey will be shortened so much. You will have a shortcut to success. You know, the only way that we learn is through failures and mistakes. That's the only way we truly learn and that it gets ingrained in us. I mean, we can learn from successes, but it's just a much lesser degree than when we're faced with an absolute failure because we'll never go back to that route. But the reality is... We don't have to learn from our own failures. We can learn from the failures and mistakes of other people and therefore avoid them. Don't make unoriginal mistakes. Don't be a pioneer in a way that just you have no roadmap. I mean, unless you're amazing at what you do, follow a roadmap that's already been laid out for you that leads you exactly where you want in life. Find people that have done what you want to do and learn from them. Find books in the industry that you're centered around, that you're focused on, if you're an entrepreneur, who else has done what you're doing successfully? Go find out what they did, go read their books, get in their head, learn their strategies and implement it the same way. And as you learn that people have experienced success before and they have detailed every step of the way for you, that begins to shortcut your life so much and your own journey and, and takes out so many struggles and frustrations. And so I want to encourage you to read for 20 minutes every day and see how that changes your life. It changed mine, it just has given me so many ideas on how to be successful, how to start new companies, 
how to do things differently, how to be effective and efficient, how to get things done. I am a completely different person now than I was three or four years ago. And every year, my goal is to learn so much and implement so much that I'm a different person at the end of the year as I was at the start of the year. And it just continues to change. My wealth changes, my income changes, my results change, my businesses grow. I'm happier, I have more freedom and free time and better systems and processes in place that allow me to experience life in a whole different way. So I hope that you will take this to heart. I hope that you'll consider it. And I want to hear from you guys. What books are you reading? What books have changed your life, changed your business methods, changed your techniques, and totally revolutionized what you experience? There's so many good ones out there. Uh, you know, maybe I'll do another video at some point where I go into very depth and detail on the books that have truly changed my life and really left an impact on me and which books I've loved and which books you know were great for certain ideas and just go into detail on that. But for now, the concept and the habit is to build a habit of reading consistently in your life. And if you do that, you will join the ranks of top men and women, of millionaires and multimillionaires and billionaires that do this consistently and experience incredible differences in their life. So thank you for watching. I'm Makai Block. This is Millionaire Success Habits on Limitless North TV. I'll have a lot of these videos coming out. I want to inspire you to change. I hope that it encourages you. Leave a comment for me. Of course, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up right now. Share it, and I'll see you on the next one. Hi, I'm Makai Block. Welcome to Limitless North TV. I want you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You might ask yourself, why should I? Every week, I'll be developing and delivering quality videos focused on helping you become a high-value, high-achieving entrepreneur, to earn more and increase your income, to build and grow your wealth, and to make insightful and impactful changes to the way that you live your life and run your businesses. You will be challenged. You will be inspired. I will motivate you to hit that next level in your life, to overcome your obstacles, and to quit struggling through your mediocrity. But most importantly, I'll be developing and delivering strategies and ideas, tips, tricks, habits, and tools that you can begin implementing in your life today to see the success and the change that you've been hoping for. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button, turn on the post notifications so you don't miss a single episode, and I will see you on the next one. I guarantee you and I promise you that you won't regret it. Welcome to Limitless North.